Back from the break here, the final segment talking about moving your body. And we require you when the show is over to do, give us 20 push-ups. And, and, and be careful, though. Don't hurt yourself. But, but Tom, when we were talking about burning body fat off, and you had a story about a guy who was obese and he tried so many things, and then all of a sudden he just tried just basic climbing stairs. And the guy, you know, surprise, surprise. Again, I think that's what a lot of people just forget is that they make this so complicated. And why? Because, folks, there's millions of people spending billions of dollars trying to get all of your money when it comes to weight loss. I think it's I 40 promise. billion a year. It is, it's a 40, it's a little, say 40 it's a billion, okay, that's the diet industry, all right, 40 billion, all right, so everybody's looking for that magic diet pill, and there really is none. The marketing hype and everything around exercise and diet is huge because everybody, one, knows the business and how much money is there, yeah. and two, they're trying to find the, some easy, neat way of losing weight. Right. Well, Sell really the gimmick. Not. Sell the gimmick, and, yes. And guess what? You'll be back for their new gimmick because you're going to be back next year, uh, probably fatter than you were. Yes. But, but the thing is, just walk. That was the gentleman's uh, comment. Finally, he tried all different aspects of exercise and diet. And yes, he lost, uh, I think he lost over 100 pounds, but it came all back plus extra. And what he finally did that was extremely successful, now he's enjoyed several of the training methods, the yoga, the stretching. So he's, in, he's enjoying some lifestyle changes. But the big thing he does is he just stays moving and he takes 10,000 steps a day. He eats mostly vegetables and fruit, a few little meats and things. He stays away from the fast food and uh, doesn't drink pop anymore. And uh, how complicated is that? That's, that's so <laughs> simple. And, and really, you cut out sugar, folks, as far as simple sugars and the pops especially. I mean, there's 12 teaspoons, guys. 12 teaspoons per pop, okay? Uh, per can of pop, there's 12 teaspoons. That equals 3.5 ounces of sugar, which equals equals a pound if you drink four pops a day. So you literally can get a pound of sugar. And I challenge anybody to try to eat a pound of sugar. So it's sugar that's getting us fat, these junk foods that are getting us fat. If you'll do basic elementary changes, and here's the the takeaway message from the show I think we're trying to tell you, is that you don't have to radically change your diet. You don't have to radically change your lifestyle. There's not a magic diet pill. All you really have to do is make these very simple changes. Watch the sugar, eat good food, eat frequently, eat small meals, Move the body. Move. And if you do that, folks, if you do that, you will regulate yourself. Now, if you're trying to be a bodybuilder, powerlifter, MMA fighter, you're going to have to go far deeper than that, okay? But we're talking about the average person, the average Joe Public out there, very basic stuff here that you can do and that you don't have. And, and what we're trying to do is comfort you here. You don't have to do all these crazy things in life that are out there on the TV and the market, latest marketing hype. You don't have to do that anymore. Very basic fundamental moves that you can do that will change your life and, and basic changes you can apply to your life. If you enjoy the strenuous stressful exercise go you bet do, do the fun things because that's what life's about have some fun uh, produce those chemicals that make you feel so good and, and the endorphins that's what i like about it sure. tom is i get in there and work out and and I, I the reason i do it to the level that i do it and i hurt so bad and i keep pushing <laughs> because i'm i'm brain damaged okay i mean you know it's that's what a lot of people think my mother thought i was brain damaged <laughs> i'll accept that so we'll, we'll rename the show uh the chiropractor and the the dumb guy i don't know so, but anyway, folks, very simple stuff here that we wanted to bring you today, kind of comfort you and let you know that you can do this, that you can apply it to your lifestyle, basic changes. And again, Tom and I have looked at this and seen this so much. We've seen the marketing hype. We've seen people who have been successful. What do they have in common? Very basic, simple changes. Tom, thanks so much. Thank you. All right. We'll see you on the next episode, folks. Thanks a lot for joining us.